What's up everybody? Jamie Bond, Fish Blue Water. Thanks for joining us for another episode here on the channel. And I couldn't be more pumped. We're just leaving Keystone Marina here in Miami. And we are a part of the first official maiden fishing voyage of the new 450Z. Ariel Pared, owner. And you know what? When you roll out a new 450Z, you got to make sure that you represent in the tournament series and the tournament season, and you got to make sure you bring the higher guns. We got on. Captain uh, Ray Roach, <laughs> Captain Ray Rocher, legendary captain of Miami. So, Ariel, we're very excited, Jamie. Thank you. Thank you for joining us today. Today is the day we get to try everything out. You know, it's all been on paper. It's all been a concept. Today it becomes reality. So this is the real shakedown. So you have. You have the full crew that you're going to be fishing the quest for the crafts and the selfie season and on the boat here today, right? Most of them. We're still missing a couple guys there. You know, they had to work today, but uh, we're, we're going to get, we have, we have the major part of the crew here, so we're really excited. And we got the captain on board today, so we're, we're going to have a lot of captain. fun. Associate captain. So here's the deal. This boat was built to fish, fish seriously, and that's what we're out here to do today. We're going to take you periodically and throughout the boat as these guys are doing their thing, kites are up and show you what this boat was built to do. Some of the special features and just have some fun and hopefully get, some, get on some fish with this guy right here behind the helm. So stay tuned. Offshore, we've got uh, wind off the north northeast, ocean's beautiful. Uh, Cap says we've got uh, some north tide, which is a change from yesterday. Uh, we got a little edge here, uh, we're setting up in about a hundred feet of water. There's been some bait showers, so we're gonna see what happens. So, as I'm sitting here, these guys got the spread up, we're three and three. I just happened to notice. Live bait tubes. These are custom designed and engineered by Mr. Ray Rocher himself. Enables these guys to drop these baits right in here and be ready to go right when they're ready to deploy the kites and the baits in the water. Such a cool invention. All right, so uh, we're breaking down the left side right now. Uh, cap saw uh, a shower in shore. We're gonna drag the right side into that shower a little bit. And then, uh, as I said earlier, this is the first day they've had some really good north tide. So he's thinking if that doesn't produce, we're gonna slide down and maybe hit double diamonds, maybe the county wreck, some of the traditional spots uh, down here in Miami and see what happens. All right, so we're running south, uh, back towards Government Cut, and Ray just hollered out for spinners. We got birds working hard here off the bow, so the baits are getting them rigged up. We're gonna cast the baits out. Oh, we got something showering right here off the. Hey. Is this the first official meat fish of the 450Z? <laughs> yes, it is. Is he? Hopefully, he's legal. He looks like he might be legal. <laughs> we can measure him. On the is flat, that a flat line? line. On the flat line. Look at that. Live CB boats official. First fish, flat. mutton snapper, on the flat line. Great job. All right. All right. Let's be clear. I'm not the captain of the boat, but 
while we've got some time and it's clear in here, I just want you guys to look at how much space this fish around helm has. These are 24 inch screens you're looking at here behind me with a 16 inch screen in the center. Unbelievable. And then as I come through here, I gotta tell you the, the field of view and you know your ability to see right over top of this console out over the bow of the boat is phenomenal. Very impressed with the job they did here on this helm. All right, so while these guys are clearing the lines behind me, I can't help but appreciate the comfort that comes with this dual row release marine seating. So talk about that a little bit, Ariel, for a second. Well, you know, everybody's been going to this dual row seating, and to be honest with you, we, we were really excited about it. You know, one thing for us was we really wanted to keep the driver centered in all the action, so that's why we built it with three seats in the front and we gave you the also the three seats in the rear, but you'll notice we shifted the inner seats a little bit. That way you're kind of looking over their shoulder. Almost everybody has a good view. Yeah, instead of head to head. Okay. Um, another thing is we elevated it slightly higher than the front row. So uh, what you'll a, notice is when, cool you're, when you're when you're sitting. Legs, by the way. <laughs> yeah, and that's another really cool feature. So we have air conditioning coming at us. We figured we're not only gonna give it to the first row, but the second row, you know, and again, look, we are elevated. So even if you've got somebody tall sitting in front of you, you're gonna be able to see just over his right shoulder, in this case, and I'm slightly taller. You know, one thing is to be able to give you that 360 degree visibility, which we really feel we achieved with this seating. So uh, no, we're no. really excited about it. Yeah, I mean, uh, there's no question that the view all the way around is exceptional. These things are super comfortable and I can actually access the outrigger while I'm sitting down here to pull in the clips. I mean, does it get any better than that? Go get me a cold beer, man. All right, I'll get it for you, Jimmy. <laughs> All right, so the left side is the strong side. Which bait? Right. What bait was it? Uh, mid. Uh, mid. Oh, mid bait? Mid what bait. Kind, big uh, gog. What kind of bait? It was a big gog. Goggle eye. Yeah. Produced the first ever sailfish on Ariel. the CV450Z. Yeah. Nice. I want you to call him. Ariel. Who? Right that, side. Hey, that means you get to decide what he has to do for the oh. first sailfish. We oh, know shit. we know what he's doing. <laughs> Congrats, buddy. Congrats. Thank you, man. Good job, Carlos. All right. Tight. We got, we got. I don't know. I'm here on the super short and uh came tight. So never never reared his head, but hopefully it's a, uh, let's go with a Wahoo. Yeah, we got a gap ready if we need it. You go through the bow, they have a gap up there. Right, Working my way through. Keep it tight, keep it tight. Working my way through, that's tight. A sailfish, or what is it, right there? Keep it wide, So this is the guy who was one of the inspirations behind this whole boat. Your first official sail, man. That's it. How first, you feel, bro? First uh, official sail on the boat. Not too bad. And so I talked about Glad earlier, you could join us. Uh, that fish was behind the boat moving around. I mean, how'd you feel about just fighting the fish and the way the, the boat handled it, the space, motors, clearance, whatever? Super easy to work around the motors. Real easy cockpit to move around. Just overall, you know, it's just as fishable as our small boats, but in a little bit more creature comfort. So. <laughs> I'm getting spoiled. Perfect. So we got one on the right side, we got one on the left side. Now they say they gotta have a tiebreaker. So, uh -oh. okay. loser buys the drink. Right, right side, of course. <laughs> Never go left. Oh. Oh, open the door! Oh, open the door! Oh, open the door. 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 Oh,
meat fish species quality it's a little short came up a little the regulation short. size got to be 33 inches from the lower jaw to the fork of the tail what do we say he's like 31 30, 30, 30, 30, 31 he's close yeah. so we're gonna let him live to grow up and get bigger and be better to eat there he goes bye bye features that they brought on board this new 450z is this integrated step system that takes you up to the tower um, this is I mean from an engineering and just building standpoint I mean this this was a significant project and something they should definitely be proud of um, so this takes you obviously all the way up top and what you see here there's been I guess some talk about this as to how easy it is to come up and down it but hopefully you can see here how easy my hands are wrapping around and I'm coming up this thing all the way to the top to where I reach up of course to the pipe and make my way up to the second station but really cool really comfortable really easy to get up and down all right so the sky looks about the same color as we started it's it's been a long day we, we covered a lot of ground in this new 450z and uh, Good day, right, guys? I mean, Great good, day. good break in session. Two sails. We had a dolphin, a couple, couple kings, a couple muttons, cobia. Yeah. Uh, my son was fired up when, he, when I told him cobia. He was also upset when I said it was a little short. But yeah. so we talked in the beginning of the video about theory, concept, and then reality. How'd you feel about the first day of fishing on the new vessel, man? It's a great day. Like I said, it's a great vessel. It was very comfortable. We really enjoyed it. Uh, we had a great captain today. Hey, we learned a lot, so, so it was an awesome day. Captain Rocher, yes. we're going to do some more videos with you in the future okay, on good. your charter boat, Miss Britt. But I wanted to ask you, you have logged a lot of miles, a lot of time, a lot of hours in the tower of many boats. This is your first day fishing on this boat. Yep. What do you think? It was a, a really comfortable boat, does everything you want it to do, very maneuverable. I was a little concerned about that with the length. Mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, Anything that stood out if, for if, you? If we don't do good, it's not the boat's fault. I can tell you that. <laughs> the pressure's on, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Right. the deal. So here's the deal, guys. Uh, obviously, we've got a channel. We're bringing a new video to you every week. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Tell us what you want to see next. And for the guys, if they want more information on this boat behind me, what's the best way for them? Just uh, give us a call at the office. CVBoats.com? Yes, yeah, CVBoats.com. And for a charter with you, how do they find you online? 788-FISH, 305-788-FISH. That's my cell or MissBritt.com. But thank you. All right. There you go, guys. Hey. We'll see you for the next video. Thank, thank you. All right. Thanks, bud.